to the tropics, the big talk this area, which not much to talk about now, looks pretty quiet down there. Uh, hard to find any kind of a wave, but uh, the models do develop this into a tropical storm and then a hurricane. Latest computer models take this over western Cuba, some of them uh, between Cuba and the Yucatan, then turn it back to the northeast toward Florida. The latest GFS, it's actually coming out right now, the 18Z GFS. That's the uh, model that starts coming out about 4.30. It has it going between Cuba and the Yucatan, and it hasn't uh, gone past that yet. We'll have to see the rest of that model run come out to see where it goes from there. But the good news is it's a little further east than the previous runs, and the European takes it across southern Florida. As a matter of fact, the GFS and the Euro model, these are the models that everyone always talks about when it comes to um, tropical systems. Uh, the Euro takes it across southern Florida, the GFS into the Gulf, and up toward it looks like uh, Destin, Florida, or maybe Pensacola. The Euro has been very, very consistent with the southern Florida landfall. If this is the case, it may not have much time to strengthen after it goes over Cuba, so that may not be a bad thing. But if it stays over the waters of the Gulf, it's going to have a lot of time to strengthen, and it could be a major hurricane if it stays out there long enough. The good news is for us, the models are shifting east. Does it mean we're out of the woods yet? Not quite yet. Still a long time to watch this, but it does look a little better. 80